hello in this video I'm I will show you how to generate TCL script for NS2 uh, with the help of NS2 script generator so NS2 script generator you can download from the link given in this browser so this is the link https colon double slash site dot google dot com site pen jung u nsg so here you can find this nsg script generator so this is just a jar file run this jar file so say for example in our case we have this jar file on our desktop so how to run it java jar and then so in this video I'm, i will show you how to make a network in network script generator how to generate a corresponding script so when this window will appear we are having two options we want to create a wired network or wireless network so say we want to go for wired network now uh, we want to create a network of two node one node having TCP agent another node having TCP sync agent and the first node having FTP agent application so first we need to create the node so when we click on the node here are some option uh, if we will choose vertical chain multiple node will be created in the single click random if you want to create randomly grid it will create a grid of the node so we will go for single so we will click so this node first node will be created and we know we need one more node we will click it here again so two nodes are created now we need to link these two nodes so here you can specify what type of link you want what type of queue you want what will be the capacity propagation delay and queue size so say we want the same parameters so in order to connect these two nodes select first one and then select second one so the link is created between n0 and n1 next step we have to create a agent so with first node we will create tcp agent here are other options as well so we are going for tcp click it and then as you can see a line is uh, attaching with the pointer so again click it so a tcp agent is attached with the node and zero and another node we will attach tcp sync click it again click it so one node having tcp as agent another node having tcp sync so tcp zero and sync one these are actually the variable which are representing this agent now we will go for applications so we will attach this ftp application with this agent so after clicking on application we will select the application type and then click on the agent and then click it again so here you can see ftp is attached with this tcp and this tcp is attached with n0 so now next thing is that we have to connect tcp0 with the sync 1 so how we will do that we will go to the agent we will click it here and we will click on the so we have connected these two agent now we want to see the tcl generated tcl file so what we have to do click on the tcl so this is the generated tcl file so now no need to know tcl if you don't know tcl in that case also you can work on ns2 by using network script simulator now we will see the another scenario so we'll close it so say now we want to go for wireless so wireless we want to create the same network so we will create network one so this is the range of this node we will create another network n zero so if this node appear in the range of n zero they will connect it automatically now we will attach tcp we will attack tcp sync with another node application we will attach a ftp application with this node and we will connect this tcp with the sync application so we have created the 
same now there is a tab you can find parameter so here you can specify simulation types name of the address file and name file here you can specify the channel type uh, phy type propagation delay routing type so all these things we can specify here this is the channel all these parameter bandwidth threshold now once the work is done we will click on tcl and this is the generated tcl file thank you very much